Hey guys, Ashley here, and today we are going to be opening some Thomas and Friends mystery minis, and also taking a look at the Thomas and Friends Adventures Hong Mai, Hong Mei, probably Hong Mei. Uh, I hope I'm saying that right. She's not a character I'm super familiar with. As you can see, I did find her on clearance, and I really wanted to uh, do a video of her for you guys. And I, I was also requested to open her on camera by a viewer of mine, and I don't remember what your name was, unfortunately, but if you see this, you know who you are, who you are, so uh, we are going to be going ahead and taking a look at her first, and she's a metal engine. Uh, I got her quite a while back, so let's go ahead then and get her out of the packaging. And then the mystery minis all came from that a uh, recent trip to the Dollar Tree I mentioned in my previous video when I opened the Transformers and Power Rangers stuff. So, there she is. She has a beautiful paint job. I love her face, by the way. Uh, let's see if I can get the camera to focus. There we go. I love her paint job. You can see. Very beautiful engine. See the bit of like the detailing, like with the coal and just just a very like I, I keep saying it, but she's just a very beautiful engine. Has nice detailing and paint and pretty good weight to her as well. I really do like these metal engines. They might be some of my favorites now. I think to collect. Let's set her down now. And for the mystery minis, I have four of them. I technically had five. But I've only got four to open. This one I opened in the car because it was already kind of partially opened anyway. I believe, I want to say she was from a separate set than the other four, but I might be wrong. Uh, I guess we'll see when I actually get them open. And this is Rosie. And I forget exactly what this paint variation of her is called. But I think it is very pretty. I really like this paint variation. I'm going to have to do a... Um, a collection video of my minis for you guys at some point because I ha I have others that I've opened off camera as well because honestly when I find them at the Dollar Tree I have a tendency of like buying one to open in the car and like it's kind of an addiction they're just really cute and I I don't know I really love love the Thomas and I, I like Thomas in general but yeah so let's go ahead and open our first blind bag these are the 2018 series 2018 series 4 and I think these are all from that series. Let me just check. Don't want to accidentally be lying. Okay. Up here, I, I actually have my Percy that I showed uh, showed last time. Percy is my favorite. And sorry I keep wobbling that. I'll set him down here with... Uh, May. I'm just going to call her May. You can see the difference in their couplers as well. And I forget which set he is from, but I do remember that I kept calling him Adventures, I believe, by accident, and he's actually from, I think, the... Is he from... I'm trying to remember if he's from the series that replaced it, I think, but I can't seem to think of its name. And I'm just so used to the Adventures ones that that's what I kept calling him. So... I know I don't have comments anymore, but at the time, I know people were kind of, like, a bit irked at me for that, so sorry. It was an honest mistake. I uh, corrected it in the description. Okay, so here is the checklist. And I have opened some of these in the past. I've opened a couple of them. I don't remember if it was on camera or not. So there's the checklist. Just thought I would show you guys that first. I'd really like to get some of, like, the Dino ones. Like, Dino Percy. That'd be really cool. Oh, I ripped my checklist. It's okay. I've got another one. I've got three other ones, technically. So, there's the checklist. Now, I'm gonna quit stalling here, and let's see which engine we got in our first set. Oh, we got, uh, James. Okay. I think I might have a regular paint job, James, but that's okay. So, there we go. There's James. Set him down. Move on to the next one. Let's 
Again, I am sorry if I keep nudging the tripod and shaking it. Got the checklist, and let's see, which engine do we have? Ooh. Is this the Percy one? Is it? Wait. Maybe? Well, please tell me it is. No, it isn't, is it? No, I, I see the back now. That's not the same as Percy. Who is this? Like, for a split second, I thought I had Dino Percy, but no, this isn't Dino Percy. Uh, but who do I have? Hmm. Interesting. Am I just overlooking him? On the checklist? Or... Not sure who this is. That's a cool paint job, though. No, it isn't Percy, though. <laughs> That's cool. Wait, what's it say? Does it say something? It's so our steam work, that's all it says. Um, it's actually a nice detail. It actually does say so our steam works on the side of the engine. I like the multicolored wheels. I have no idea which one this is, though. Okay, so let's go ahead and move on. Checklist. And... Oh, I've got this one is, um, is it Emily, I think? Just a second. Millie, sorry. <laughs> I don't know why I thought this was Emily. So this is Watermelon Millie. Yeah, I remember now because I kind of kept, I think I kept, um, I want to say I made a joke about that. I think I opened this one on camera, actually. Maybe. I'm not sure now, but I really do love this paint job for Millie. It's just a really cute paint job in general. I love the like the theming. It's very summery, which is really fitting since it is summer now. But yeah, so there is Millie. And let's see who we have in our last bag. And we have a checklist. No, just kidding. Um, who do we have? Ooh. Oh, this is, is this another Rosie? Is this Rosie? This is Rosie. See, I know some of my engines when I see them. Okay, so is this, I think this is like a bubble gum paint gel. Let me refer to the checklist though. Or wait, this is cam camo, really? This is camo, uh, Rosie, apparently. I was thinking it was like one of the bubble gum ones. <laughs> like, um, is it the stuff that has, yeah, like, they have, like, these blow pop ones. I don't know. It just looks like bubble gum to me. But that is pink camo. I guess I can see it now. That's really cute. I like that. I like that a lot, actually. And I'm not one who normally likes the color pink. Look at that face. It's actually interesting. When you look at the faces on the two rosies and see, like, the slight, slight difference... It's very slight in certain details, like the lips a bit different. Obviously, you can see this is a big difference. I don't know why I like Rosie so much. Just a, a cute, just a cutie, I think. <laughs> and you can, oops, they don't stay together very well, but you can couple these together. Like so. Just let me look for the camera to refocus. There we go. And hopefully I can find out who this guy is. Or a girl. And I can put that in the description for you guys. Or maybe put it up on the video if I remember. Come on. Add you to the train. Alright. So. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and i just want to throw in real quick the reason that the coupler is different on these versus on the older model is actually because these can be attached behind the um motorized engines like on the uh 
Uh, what are they called? I have I have a lot of them. I track master. For some reason I never can remember that name. So just thought I would put that out there just in case anyone maybe is just kind of getting into them more recently or just didn't know. So yeah, so thank you guys so much for uh watching this video. I hope you guys liked it. Percy, please stay where I put you. And if you did, I hope to see you guys next time. Bye, guys. Oh, and don't forget to like this video. Follow me on my social medias if you're interested. Those are going to be linked in the description, as always. Okay. Now, bye, guys.